So we've had a little problems with our audio recorder today, but uh, Guitar Jack came to the rescue. Uh, here we've got um, our iPhone, which we have hooked up to the Guitar Jack. We've got a little gaffer tape on there just to kind of keep it all together. And we've taken a preamp and uh, run the, uh, a boom mic into the preamp and then we ran out of the line out into the guitar jack there onto the uh, eighth inch line in and basically we just created a new song and uh, we just recorded uh, each take onto, new, onto a new track and then when we got to the uh, fourth track we just start a new song and start over again so this is probably a little unconventional but um, the guitar jack really saved the day and it was a really really great input into the iPhone that we wouldn't have had otherwise. Uh, David, what did you think about um, doing it this way? I actually liked a couple things about it. Um, as I would stop, uh, I don't want to stop because we're actually doing our audio at the moment with this. As I would stop, it would automatically advance me to uh, the next track and I could just slide to record. And then what we tried to do was actually put each take uh, on one, two, and three, and four. So as we did a scene, we'd basically shoot four different takes and we'd have audio on one, two, three, and four, and then I'd do a new song on our next shot. I could um, preview the shots pretty easily. I could monitor them pretty easily. So it worked out pretty good. All right, so here's our rig. We've got it gaff taped up. Uh, it was a little unconventional, but it, uh, it seemed to do okay. I remember uh, hearing the other day, some, or uh, reading the other day into a forum, uh, someone who was asking whether you could use it as a field recorder, and I, uh, I had my doubts, but there you go. We used it as a field recorder on a video shoot here in uh, Old Cloverdale in Montgomery, Alabama. So, um, Guitar Jack, worth it? I think so.